We've been talking about the leading edge of this storm coming into the north. You can see that with the radar behind us. Yeah, we want to bring in Karma Dickerson. She is in Santa Barbara for us. Uh, Karma, how's the situation there? We're seeing heavy winds, heavy rains already flooding on the street. And of course, being Santa Barbara, you've got to keep your eye on the ocean. And there's some pretty extraordinary things that we're seeing already. Meanwhile, take a look at the palm trees. The way the wind is whipping here as you step out, you can see very quickly while people are being told to stay inside and to really be clear. Now, there are some mandatory evacuations in place in Santa Barbara. There's a flash flood watch that's going on. And if you look straight ahead of us, you can see what's happening here on the beaches. Now, we should note that state beaches within Santa Barbara County are closed. And here's one of the reasons why. This is a boat that, as far as we can tell, has become unmoored. It was it appears to have been moored offshore. For example, if you can see to the left, the visibility is pretty low, but you can see some boats that are still out there in the ocean. And it would appear that because of the heavy winds, because of the rain, and of course because of the waves, that this boat has made its way to the shore. Of course, that can be pretty dangerous if you have people that are out and about on the sand. We have, of course, seen people coming out to, to take a look at that. That's generally not advised. But, of course, it's not something that you see every day. These heavy rains continue to pour. We've seen many flooded streets as we've been driving throughout Santa Barbara, trying to keep an eye on just what everything that's going on. There are some areas that are definitely prone to regular flooding. So people who live in those areas are told to take precautions. And so we're going to continue to keep an eye on these conditions out here in Santa Barbara. But you can see things are changing pretty quickly. People are advised to keep an eye on those watches and those warnings. Reporting live from Santa Barbara, I'm Carmen Dickerson, NBC4 News.